Hey guys, leg shot here. Um, let me just plug in my controller and then we'll get started. It's gonna be, I think, I can't remember if I saved, but I think I did some side quests earlier. One sec. Doesn't like my controller. I'm gonna have to unplug the other one. logged on the other day to do um, the side questing. Check my inventory really. Yes, I did too. Oh, okay, okay. I think I know where. Um, okay, so can do some side questing here and then uh, a little bit of grinding. So I didn't really know this about the um, the PS2 version and the DS version, but there's like a, like an extra island they added, um, or like little knickknacks that you can find in the game, and then you put them on display. Yeah. I thought that was kind of cool. So we're gonna go. Um, knick-knack guy and then put my stuff on display in his museum and there's like really nothing um like there's n it, it again just a little side quest there's nothing um to the main story about this but i just want to do it for a sense of completion i guess so, plus it's cool seeing like the actual items Probably switch up Bianca. Still too weak. Um, so I think I have to go to the Metal Kingdom first. Unless I did that, but I think I did. I don't think I saved it. Straight down. Maybe I, maybe I already went there. So let me check the other island first. Maybe. Sure. Okay. I like so much XP from like everyone now. Monsters. Big two first. Yep, right here. 
Okay, so I haven't got in the item yet. Okay, so I gotta go to the Metal King, uh, Metal King's castle. I guess like the first time I played this game, some almost 20 years ago, I didn't know about the knickknacks. Um, probably because of my lack of Japanese. So, yeah. Um, kind of cool you know, to find out about it now, that there's like extra stuff to do in the game. Again, I don't think, even if you collected everything, I don't think there's anything special that happens. It just, um, yeah, it just a sense of completion. Gotta talk to the Little King. I'm not gonna buy anything from them. I need to keep all my medals for now. something about it. Okay, so I think I'm missing a step here. They have to come at night. Oh, get him. Yeah, okay. Not bad. Um, so what the heck am I missing? There it goes. And I think I go outside. There we go. I have to sleep at the end, maybe. Now I got the little, I got the big metal that'll let me go inside the uh, magnet. On this island, there's metal slimes actually, and uh, I can try to hunt the metal slimes there afterwards. <laughs> I gotta grind a little bit, but I do want to catch um, one or two monsters back in the beginning area, so I'm gonna go there first. Yes.
Auto XP for three guys. Yeah, did that that guy learn any good spells? He learn any heal? He doesn't have any heal spells. No. Be good for when he be yeah, okay. Okay, so he's not a heal type. Backer. Finally go inside. Um, can't do anything here till night time. Yeah, rock polish. Polisher. I'm gonna go back out and come back at night time. Hmm. Crazy thing is, um, I was supposed to get the Lamp of Darkness in that cave in Santa Rose, and, um, yeah, I, I went back and checked, and the treasure chest it was supposed to be in wasn't there. Oh, these guys, I can, um, I think I can capture one of them. Capture and recruit one of them. Ooh, damn. Oh my god. And two hits. Jeez. I don't even give that much XP. <laughs> okay, well, if I can catch one of those, that'd be great. I wonder what love he is. On the side. Oh, grad! Um, oh, I know I can catch these guys, too, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, no, maybe it was the other colored. Can't get the red dragon. It's the um, it's the blue one. What else can we get here? Okay, yeah, so I can recruit the metal. Oh damn, these guys are super buff. Maybe I should train on the water because they're pretty damn strong. Not really worth the XP for how strong they are, I don't think. Well, I mean, that was okay. That one was okay. Okay. Um, um yeah, so let's go in here. So I can now put stuff on display from my bag. <laughs> yeah, I stole that scarecrow. Oh, I got the yummy one. Oh, okay, I have it. Okay, I didn't realize it. So, I'm stupid. Now I can turn day to night. I can always come back and pick these up later, but... And some of them, I think some of them are like update, uh, upgraded or something. Go to something. Um, about it. This one, like, okay, I can put that on display. That one's not fully upgraded yet. Just that's okay. Cool. So, my item is on display. Alright. Let's go try to recruit a couple monsters now. I want to go... I'm trying to catch the little bats, Draki. Ducky is, um, he can get up to level 99. He's basically like a slime level character. Um, but 
yeah, he, he gets pretty buffed in the end, towards end game, and he can hold the best weapon in the game out as well. If I can recall correctly. That worked. He'll be part of my end game team later on. Not coming out. See if there's anything else around here. I mean, there are other monsters I can catch around here, but. Yeah, it's not. Not, um, not good because they have like low max levels. Okay, these are guys. The lucky. And they're like supposed to be one out of four. Still don't want to join me though. One in four chances to catch one. Of them. Get the orcs too. King slime would be a nice catch if I can catch that. I don't remember where to find the heal slime. I think it's near Nine Hut. I want him too. So we'll try to get this. I'm looking at is from DS. I think there's like two monsters that I can't catch. Um, there was a list a long time ago that was like really good. Like with pictures too. Or for the PS2 version. Dancing jewel, but I thought they're not rich jewel. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. I killed the Draki in the wrong order. I think this is for Super Nintendo, but I should be able to catch everything in the Super Nintendo. Could catch the goodie bag. Dancing Jewel. Kill these guys, this one guy first. Any healer, I wish I could catch one of those too. Oh, really? Still don't want to join me. Full cast. Merlin's actually his strongest spell is Big Yagon, so that's not. Yeah, I mean, it's not terrible. I'm on Metal Zone, I guess. 
He learns to bang it out on next level. He'll be he'll be good till near end game, and then basically I'll switch him out. One more party? Yes, yes, I got him. <laughs> Happy. Okay. Um. Send the slime back. Slime is level 31. Does he learn anything good soon? Okay, he doesn't learn anything until 45. But this guy. This is Max. Let's see. Let's see. Look at the list. This guy. Oh, this guy goes to level 99 also. They all do. What does he learn though? Uh. This list must be different then. This is just for Nintendo, I'm guessing. This must be for Super Nintendo. Okay, I'm gonna put him away for now. The list is nice, but it's not what I'm looking for quite. Thank Lion Hunt. Yo, yo! Yeah, I just caught Draki. Um, trying to catch the Hoiny Slime now. I think it's in this area, but I can't recall. It's either here or it's closer to Santaro's. But let me, let me grind here for a minute. I'm looking for an actual EQ5 PS2 list of recruitable monsters. Um, that's so hard because like every all of them are in English, and I'm like I don't know the English names of these monsters. Need to wheel for I can catch these guys, Yeti. Probably I might as well. I don't want him on a party though. Rocky is useful though, because yeah, he gets up to level 99, so he'll have good stats by endgame. What the hell are these names? Metal Slime. Okay, yeah, so Metal Slime looks like confirmed you can catch him inside the cave. But that cave kind of sucks. Oh, cool. Is there, um, there's this monster called Jail Cat. But is that in PS2 version? I think that's only in, on the DS. More, yeah, I got metal. What did I just kill it anymore? Yeah, there's two monsters, right? Um, the DS version. What ones were they? Was it the um, Jailcat? Sounds oh, okay. Yeah, Jailcat was one of them, probably. And then the was it the Jewel? Odoru Hoseki? Or is it a different one? Trying to find that. Oops. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to look it up. 
I can use my mouse and control at the same time, so... <laughs> See what is this for? generation. This is okay. So yeah, the dancing jewel, the little seki you can catch in the SNES version. So it must be recruitable in this version. Okay, and I saw the eliminator earlier. Arc demon. Oh, arc demon. I kind of want one though. I can catch both of these. Oh. The Lionx? What is the Arc Demon? I'm trying to figure out which one's the Arc Demon. Okay, I'll take the Yeti. E is going back to the monster Jisong. Okay. Um, Arc Demon. What do they call it? Arc Demon is nowhere so... <sighs> These are all English names, so I don't know which one it is. It's... I think it's probably like the second to last one on the list of, um... Um, the DS list. Um, let's see, so I want to catch the cactus. Catch the cactus, and then... I still haven't found the heel slime. Okay, looks like the cat... Yeah, with the child clothing. Yeah, exactly. I know what they look like in Dragon Quest 6, but I don't, yeah, I feel like I've never seen them in Dragon Quest 5. Those oh, wait. Pitchforks and wings? Isn't that. Isn't that the mini demon? Mini demon, mini demon. Is there another one with a pitchfork? on the list, I don't really see it. Huh, okay. When I get there. Sure, I'll take a look. Uh, oh! I don't, I don't think I even see this one on the list. Oh, never mind, I see it. Ah, okay. Okay, um, oh, damn, he would have been hella good, too. He goes up to level 99. Damn. Um, I want that Barbados monster. He goes up to level 99, and he's a strong monster. He's like 1 and 256 chances. I think right now, yeah, my main focus today is just catching, recruiting monsters. Yeah, Barbados, 1 out of 256 though, but that should be easier than catching Metal Slime or Hagada Method. Go for it. Mad Dragon, Lionix, I've caught those before. Oh, should I just try to catch everything? Yep, yep. Zombie. Did not the not the same monster? Oh really? <laughs> well, I remember our friend had one. He had a uh, Hagenemeta on his team on the SF. Uh, super fun conversion. Yeah, so I guess I guess it is that big of a deal, huh? I, I gotta catch one. Now I gotta show it off.
<laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> that, that'll be that'll be the point of my stream to to hunt for a, for a one. End game. <laughs> Yep, exactly. We never caught one, and we replayed this game so many times on different on different systems, and still, still can't catch one to this day. Yeah, I don't really need the dancing needles that badly. So. Okay, but it seems like the heal slime isn't here. I wonder if I go. I wonder if I go um that cave to the east if they show up or uh, let me see. Let me see what I don't see where you see them. The uh, heal slime should be near the beginning area, I think. Um let me try. Around here. Oh wait, that's the bar. <laughs> the hell is in? the heal sign for sure. I want the Sama Yo Yoroi guy. I'll get him next after the heal slime. Was it here though the heal slime or was it down? Look around this area for a sec. Time. I'm just gonna look see where I can catch one. For me. This one. This one doesn't tell me either. One list that tells me like where to catch them around. Okay. One go. Oh, okay. Two time. Hmm. I'll see that on my list. Ghost around town. Walking corpse and Wilbur Cave. Caves. Oh, five. These English names are just hard to figure out. Oh, okay, okay. Double oh, okay, okay. I think I know them. Um. Yo slime looks like I have to go to the, the tower here, I think. Yeah, okay. It just... Okay, there's like, there's like three monsters I can catch in the tower, so I'm gonna go over there. Or like I was able to catch these, but it looks like you can't. Oh, I can switch out Bianca. I don't want her.
Um, what else can I cast? Oh shit, I can't go inside anymore. Uh, I catch him on the outside? Hope so. If I had known that, I would have stuck around this area <laughs> earlier to catch him. Oh wow. Um, that's yeah, they're not that strong though. King Slime only goes up to level thirty. That's kind of a shame. Crap. Catch a hawk man. Oops. Party. A lot of good monsters I can catch. I need to catch that whole hero party. Battle pip. Pip fighter. Pippin. <laughs> Wiz Pip. That sounds funny. I'm not skinning buff, man. Oh, metal slime. Catch the key metal after get up to level sixty. Kind of useful. Okay, there we go. These guys catch one of these, and I'm good. Must be a low catch rate. A high catch rate. Sure. Yeah, so one in thirty-two. Yeah, okay. well, it's a little bit harder to catch than the other ones. Goodie bags, the uh, dancing jewels are really hard to catch though. One, okay, they're one in 64. Some of these are telling me different things. I'm reading one in 16 for the DS version. It must be, these catch rates must be different per game also. So I'll assume it's like one in 64. That's why they're hard to catch. 
Sure, if they're any good or whatever. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, what? Nope. Ah, come on. Oh, some monsters you can only get. After the game, then. like any monsters I can only get now. Some you have to wait till you have kids. Catch the main. Oop, metal science. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes. Oh. Why can't I hit? Ah, oh, bullshit. <laughs> I think I already caught one of these guys. Can I really catch them here though? I don't have my... I don't have my uh, thing with me. My wagon. That'd be a waste of time if that's but but it could. Yeah, I don't know about that. Maybe I can't anymore. Huh. Was it only when I was here earlier that I can catch him? In which case I need to find another zone with a heel slime? I'm gonna have to Google this. I don't want to just keep wasting time if that's the case. Oh crap. Ugh. Oh. 
Until we summon heal sign, kill the enemies, digging. Can I not recruit? Yeah, no problem. Can I not recruit the slime? Uh, I'm not sure if I can recruit monsters here anymore. Because I don't have the wagon. Oh, you know what? I know a better place. Okay. Power lower max. Oh. What? Yeah, I don't think. I don't have the wagon. I don't think I can capture them anymore here. So. Oops, I mean, the other. They say. Online, people say. Just then until this. Um. Oh, okay. Some of your yoroi. You can wait till um they summon them. It looks like. So, and I want to catch one of those too. Maybe I'll catch those first. On here. Yeah, I gotta catch them all. Gotta catch the good ones. <laughs> Just gotta catch the good ones, that's all. I wish I can catch one of these guys. Who the hell's. Oh, okay. I know where the same place I was at. But yeah, I don't think I can grab them. There. Go for a No slime. Yeah. Um, that's pure slime. Okay, yeah. This might be like the best place to catch them. You just gotta wait till they get summoned. These guys come out. Discrimination against uh, weak monsters. <laughs> against bad monsters. Only the good ones. But what if they're all good? I'm not discriminating at all. Yeah, see? But, you know, my hand might accidentally sli slip and they know some of them. <laughs> no, I'll catch. If they join my party, of course, I'll catch them all. <laughs> yeah, miss swap in this game, right? I think the armor comes up around here too. Um, now I want to catch the better cure slimes too afterwards. <laughs> yeah, I know. So huge, these characters. I guess they're fat. Look at that. My whole party, like, <laughs> run over that town, that village. <laughs> yeah, basically, I could put that whole town in my carriage, man. It's crazy. Take a shift to milk and melon. Put your slime. Which one is the cure slime though? Is that? 
that. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's the level 51. Okay, here's the Samayoyoi. So I want to keep him alive for a little bit. Well, I want to catch him too, actually. So I'll kill him. Kill him. Oh, what's his rate? Um, damn, he's also 161 and 64. Yeah, if he if he summons a uh, heal slime, you have that graphic in front of you. Uh, yeah, I'm on my left screen, I can see. Yeah, I'll, I'll send it to you in a sec. Yeah, I put it in the I put it in the Discord. I got that. Yeah, I sent that one. So I'm looking at that one, just to see most of them. But just Jail Cat and Arc Demon I can't catch. Things like that. Yeah, I can catch the armor here. And then, oh, there we go. Yeah, Arc Demon, I guess they just added him in later for the DS. <laughs> are they, yeah, are they even in the game in PS2? Wow, listen to that bass. Bass. Yeah, I'm not sure if I recall seeing them in the PS2 version. They might have just, yeah, literally added them. Because Jailcat, I don't think they added in the original or this game. I think they're um, PS only. Like, the Jailcats are like monsters in uh, Dragon Quest VI, though, right? Yes. Come my party. Come my party. Yeah, I think I think jail cats are from Dragon Quest 2. One of the weak monsters. Oh, I think I learned Biggie Dagon. Biggie Dagon. Ha ha ha. Now he's actually pretty good now. Have that. Yeah, I guess I'll just stick around here until I catch one of those plus the heal slime. Probably gonna take a break around 6.30 to eat and then, um, and maybe play some Resident Evil 2 after that. A lot of them here. Bound to catch one, right? They should just, they should really let you capture these guys. Mm. Yeah, would have been like the tougher, stronger version of Slime Knight basically, right? That's why I wanted one. <laughs> Have them evolve like Pokemon. Oh, I missed. I remember these guys were like doing a lot of damage when I first came to this part, and then now they're only giving me one damage. <laughs> Yeah, 
was getting pwned. Now they're getting pwned. Oh, still giving me five damage. Four damage. I guess my uh, slime knights have more defense. You know what's getting pwned? My back. <laughs> Old man back. <sighs> not like using this ergonomic chair. Um, not lately, no. If I go see a chiropractor, that works. I think my next Cairo visit's two weeks out. Oh no, no, it's like three weeks out. It's the first week in November. Yeah, it's a while out. Oh cool. How about like um uh uh, Superman, not Superman, the the one where you're like on your forearms and then you just like create a bridge. Nope. They come for me, man. Oh wow, the metal rider ran away. Like the one where you're like on your forearms on the ground and on your toes and you just hold that position. Planking, yes, planking. <laughs> That's what it's called. I used to, yeah, I used to do those, like, all the time. Make a bridge. <laughs> so people can walk on your back. <laughs> That's, uh, yeah, that one's a good core exercise. <laughs> I had to, I had to unblock <laughs> Man, this thing, I have to allow, I have to put down allowable words or something. <laughs> Eons. <laughs> apparently, apparently uh, Twitch thinks so. <laughs> oh my god, this GX cab guy, he just... Potty mouth. <laughs> the discriminatory words he's using. <laughs> very, very inappropriate. <laughs> Let me heal my main guy. Still haven't got one though. So basically, what they say, the strategy to catch the heal slime is to just find those knights and then just keep blocking until he summons a, a heal slime. And the heal slime's only 1 in 16, I think? One, oh, 1 in 32, actually, so that might also be a little bit tough. But I've done, I've done a couple of 1 in 64s already, I think. Yeah, and then the thing is, you gotta wait for them to get summoned, so that could take a while. I caught the uh, I caught the flamethrower. That one's one in sixty-four. Yeah, the armors are one in sixty-four as well. But they show up pretty frequently here. Is that flamethrower the hardest one to catch so far that I've caught? I think he is. Yeah, I, I caught the magician already. They're, they're, yeah, one of the easiest ones. Them and the slimes and brownies. All of the later, most of them later monsters. Oh, there's a couple later. Oh, Golem is like only one and four? I wonder if that's only the... Yes, chances though. 
What if I had like a whole army of golems? Yeah, I got the apple too. Uh, I haven't ran into Fat Rat yet, but once I get there. Okay, here's my chance. These guys first. Um, if he summons the heal slime first, I'll kill him first and then go for the heal slime. Oh, I got the armor. First armor. If I put it on, I'll put it on if Kitty's here. <laughs> then he can hear the he can hear the cursed music. <laughs> yeah. I think the the stats also suck. But yeah, if, if Kitty logs on, I don't think he will, because he probably won't wake up for a couple more hours. I should, yeah, I need to put it on when he's when he's uh, watching the stream, though, just so he can hear the cursed music. <laughs> yeah, you have to, yep, you have to go to church to un uncurse it. I don't think the, um, uh, chaotic... Uh, cures it he just um it's only for like what is it? can you get no can you use it no chaotic is just for mahi isn't it? for paralysis during battle i guess that's what it was yeah mahi i thought like it was for curses too in other games but maybe not this one yeah caddy is for um for poison Yeah, I thought Chaotic in other games was to un undo the curses too, though. I don't have anyone with Chaotic right now. Yeah. I was thinking in like later versions, like Dragon Quest 6 and later. I might. I might be wrong about that. Uh, I don't need any more of these guys. Kinda suck. Only go up to level 30. I don't want to catch one of the rocks. But they only go up to level 20, but it'd be cool just having them. How far in the game? Um, uh, I married. I just married Bianca, basically. So I have to go to Gramvania and then have the kids. Yeah. And they get kidnapped or something, and I go rescue them. I'm like spoiling the whole story. <laughs> yeah, but I think I over leveled too. <laughs> yeah. I think at this point, most people who enjoy the series probably have played Dragon Quest V, so it's okay to spoil it. <laughs> if they stumble upon my, my video or my streams. <laughs> but yeah, I have to um, go to Granvania, have the kids, they get captured. Yeah, not for SNES. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of them. And then, um, you turn into stone, and, and then you come back. <laughs> still, still a ways to go. As far as, uh, level, I think my level's pretty good. <laughs> Turning to stone for, like, ten years. Or eight years or something. Yeah, that's like that. They they did that in the movie too. They did the the stone part. Um, but yeah, the 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 movie's weird. They didn't have um 
the daughter, they only had the son, so they weren't twins <laughs> in the movie. Yeah, the Dragon Quest Your Story. You just go download it later. It's the story is yeah, basically Dragon Quest V up to the second boss. Um, with a little bit of tweak to it. Our third third boss? Second boss? I guess he's the Yeah. Came out um like twenty nineteen maybe? No, maybe twenty no, twenty twenty, twenty twenty one. It was on Netflix. <laughs> that's that's how I watched it the first time. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> oh, shoot. I think that's okay if I kill the armor. Second to last, because these guys aren't recruitable. Or this one in 64, so that's pretty hard to catch. <laughs> I keep on saying catch when it's supposed to be recruit. <laughs> I feel like I'm enslaving them. <laughs> oh, there's the slime. Okay, I'll kill them first. I'd rather just get the slime over with first. Ah, come on. <laughs> yeah, I think, um... But I do think the first time I went up that tower, I went with my wagon, so I was able to recruit monsters there. But then now, when you go, you don't have your wagon. You have to kill. Ugh. Oh, cool. Three of them. Yeah, no problem. I'm used to talking to myself now, anyways. <laughs> While playing this game. Another armor. They don't want to join my team. Come on. <laughs> Stupid bastard armors. I think I caught one in my old save file. surprised I caught three slime knights though because yeah, I've never I've never even I don't think I've even caught in two most of the times I've played yeah three seems pretty tough Yeah, CG. Yeah, it is. It's it's visually very good and the story it's yeah, it follows the, the game storyline. Just it's a little bit different like how um they meet up and stuff. The last part's def definitely different. <laughs> Yeah, I forgot. I forgot how I found out about it. Um, must have been like a Facebook ad or something. And then 
or article or ad, and then I mentioned it was on Netflix, and then I went to look for it. Come on, yeah. I didn't. I didn't randomly just look on Netflix. I like I read it somewhere first, and then I was like, "Oh, it's on Netflix." Still haven't caught one. Killed quite a few already now, too. The, the English version? Yeah, I heard it's good, but I, I'm just not gonna watch it because it's English. It's dubbed in, or it, it actually is in English. I'm just like, oh, I don't want to listen to One Piece characters not in their Japanese voices. What What would be cool is if they dub it in Japanese using the actual Japanese voice actors. <laughs> Then, then I would consider watching, if they did that. But, uh, you know, the other day I was, um, I was watching other people's, um, if they were retired soon. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I know. Good evening. <laughs> um, the other, the other day I was watching, um, Someone else, uh, a Japanese player, play Resident Evil 2, uh, or Biohazard 2, and the voices were actually in Japanese. I was surprised. I thought Resident Evil or Biohazard, I thought they were voiced in English, but Japanese subtitle for Biohazard. Or maybe there's an option to change the voices to Japanese or something. So that was kind of weird, like listening to um, a remake. Remake. I think the original, it was English, um, for Biohazard. Yeah, it, it was. No, I was expecting it was going to be uh, an English cast, but it looks like they did have Japanese uh, voice characters. So it was kind of weird listening, hearing a different voice for Leon and Claire. <laughs> It was, um, the zombies in the country. <laughs> yeah, the, the zombies still moan in, in zombie language. <laughs> but yeah, it's like Annette and Claire and uh, even the, the doctor, William Birkin, they're all like speaking Japanese. I was like, oh crap, this is different. That was kind of cool to watch. Just watching this um, Japanese female player play for like the first time ever, and she's actually pretty decent. And it's funny because she went straight to hardcore mode instead of standard. I'm like, damn, that's that's tough. But even in hardcore mode, I feel like they're dying faster than how long it takes me to kill them in standard mode. Yeah, when, when I play in standard, I can't even kill a zombie in like, it takes me like 10 shots. I, like, I shoot them in the head sometimes like 10 times and they still survive, I'm like, what the hell? Yep, yep. I mean, it took her a while to figure out like where to go and stuff, but she's actually pretty good at like killing, killing zombies and um, even the bosses, like she did a pretty good job on the bosses. She died, you know, she died multiple times, but um, she did a really good job. On hardcore, if I tried, like, my first time, yeah, it would have taken me a while. Even on standard, well, I think on standard, the second, the second boss is always the hardest for me. Um, the third boss is kind of, it is tough, but then if you save up enough ammo, like Magnum and Shotgun Bullets, he's not not that difficult. Always that second boss is just like really hard because like you have so little room to run. <laughs> and he grabs you, he'll grab you, 
and then you run the, the container into you. That's the one where you push the switch for the container and then slams into the boss and knocks him off. But if he grabs you where the container is, then you get hit too and you die. <laughs> But um, yeah, well, it's it's funny because I learned something while watching that that female player play. Um, a decent way to beat that boss using the flamethrower. <laughs> so I did that, and um, yeah, I was able to get him on one of the rounds. It, I I died to him like three times. I think Kitty was watching me three or four times. It's funny because like. The first continue, it's like, you start with him right in front of you. I was like, what? I wasn't ready for that. I thought I was going to set you back to the other room. <laughs> Freaking Iba. Oh, uh, yeah. That was the... Wait, was that... Are you talking about the last boss at the very end? Or no, not the last boss, right? The um Oh yeah, 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 that boss. Yeah, he's the second boss. They're hitting the switch for the container, right? Yeah, that's the second boss. Yeah, Birkin second form. Is that um that was the one I did yesterday, right? If you watch that, that's the second boss. That one's the toughest in my opinion, that one's the toughest boss. Yeah, <laughs> apparently. But I did I did use the flamethrower on the last on the last boss as well, or uh, not the not the very last boss, the third boss. The third boss is the like he's ginormous and has like four arms. Or wait, two arm two giant giant arms, I guess. Do you have four arms? I don't remember. You might have four arms. But um. Yeah, it's the second boss um, where you fight on like a little platform, and then there's like a switch you have to press. Yeah, then that's the second boss. <laughs> if I use the flamethrower on him, that's the second boss. The the first boss, I knifed him down most of the way. Well, I like to say most of the way, but apparently he, um, yeah, I, 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 I used the knife so much it broke after I stabbed him with it. And then I had to shoot him with the shotgun like four times, and then the handgun like ten times or so. And then I heard the game, um, the knife, the knife breaks in in RE2 remake. Yes, <laughs> that's why that's why there's an unlimited knife once you beat the game. That's like the first um, first item you get. Uh, and then if you beat it. Like with a A grade or something, you get the hand unlimited handgun or something. And then to get the rocket launcher and the um, the assault rifle, you have to beat in like hardcore mode, um, which is hardcore mode under like three hours or something, with only uh, three saves or less total. I mean, if you're gonna do three saves, that's you know, you get ink ribbons, you probably get like 20 ink ribbons in the game. 20 or 25 or something. But yeah, that that's what makes it hard, that you only get three saves. Um, you could continue. You could continue. You can use first aid sprays, unlike the, um, the old RE2. The old RE2, to get S rank, you can't use a first aid spray, I remember. Um, but I... I can't remember if you can... It might have been similar with the saves as well. Yeah, it was just herbs in the old one. But the remake, it's okay to use uh, first aid sprays. It just It's more about the time and how many saves you use. So you have to break like three hours on hardcore with only... Um, with only three saves. And you can continue after you die. But all the time, still can, your your timer still keeps running. So if you spend a lot of time and then you die and then to do like a boss fight and you do it over and over, then you waste a lot of time. So that's probably I I probably only wasted like ten minutes 
extra with continues like that. But yeah, I, I wouldn't have gotten this rank because I it, it took me three three hours thirty seven minutes. It was better than I thought. I thought it would take me like four and a half hours or so to finish it, <laughs> considering I didn't have any unlimited weapons. Tonight, I kind of want to start Claire, either Claire A or Claire B, and then um, I don't think I'm going to finish it today. I'm going to stop a little bit early, but um, I'll probably maybe pick it up tomorrow. You know, since October, got to play the, the spooky horror games. Maybe I'll play some Resident Evil 3 as well. Uh, Resident Evil 4 would probably just be frustrating to watch me because I keep dying, but at the same time, it might be a good way for me to, to push me to finish the game. <laughs> so I might, I might stream it. Yeah, RE4 Remake. I'm like, I think I'm about three-fourths of the way done with the game right now. So I'll probably just continue. Yeah, that game is just really hard. It's not, I wouldn't say the game is that scary or anything. It's, it's more action, but it's super difficult. I guess it kind of gets scary like later on. I've already read some spoilers though. I never, I never beat the original. Yeah, too scary. Um, three, three. I wouldn't. Three remake. I wouldn't say is really that scary. It's more just the thrill of running away from uh, Nemesis most of the time. <laughs> but like the zombies, they don't really like pop out at you like unexpectedly. I don't think. It doesn't feel that scary in comparison to number two. Come on, join my party. I'm gonna go on for about 20 more minutes. Hopefully I can catch this guy or the heel slime. Ow, come on. <laughs> And it's funny um, when I played yesterday, like the first the first zombie bit me. <laughs> I was like, "Damn it!" My um my my joystick on the PS4 isn't working that well, so it's like it's hard to make them run. <laughs> yeah, basically. I was still my health was still the green? Oh, it might have been yellow after the first bite. It was probably still green. I think it was like yellow um yellow green. It was like taking a little tap basically. But I think in um in hardcore mode, I think if you take a zombie bite, you automatically get into danger after one bite. Unless it's like your ankle or something, then it's like caution. Like the yellow from pink stuff, oh, yes. Yeah, hardcore hardcore mode is tough. Like regular zombies are like a real big threat. <laughs> yes, the character in the game. Even themselves. Um the one, well, the defense mechanism, like, there's no dodging in RE2 like there is in RE3. So the defense mechanism is, um, yeah, probably right. The, the defense mechanism is having, like, a knife or a flashbang or a grenade, and then you use it to, like, stab the zombie uh, to kind of parry it or stuff a, stuff a grenade in its mouth. <laughs> If it were to happen, though, and you get bitten once, you'd probably be in pretty bad danger. <laughs> Assuming they take a chunk, they bite a chunk out of you.
And also, how does how does Leon and Claire not turn into zombies after taking bites, right? Yep, exactly, just from the blood loss. I mean, if it's a light bite, you know, maybe it's fine. Like, they only get the part of your forearm, like the, front, the piece of it. If it's like the whole forearm and then they, claw, they, they chew it out, then yeah, you're gonna die. <laughs> Ooh, damn, that hurt. Um, okay, I'll go for the slime. <laughs> yeah. And the herbs, herbs heal you instantly, and so do first aid sprays. Super realistic. You know, just the uh, handgun ammo just laying around everywhere. Not just the police station, but in the sewers and everything. Inside uh, the Umbrella's Hive. With all these puzzles. In the sewers, you have to, you find the flamethrower just like hanging there. You have to solve a puzzle. <laughs> yeah, just like, oh, I'm dying. Spray. Oh, okay, I'm better. Like, it's like eating a senzu. <laughs> Super reals. <laughs> and then the uh, the magic the magic storage box where you put items in one and show your items show up in other boxes. <laughs> I feel like hardcore though. They could have made it. They could have made it so that the the box you drop off stuff in is the box that has all your items. That you just have to like bring in, bring all the stuff with you towards the end or something. <laughs> I feel like they could have done that. I mean, like some there there's a reward or like a trophy if you can beat the game without ever using the storage box. Tube system. So why couldn't I have just vacuumed myself in there and to get to the last area? <laughs> because you need to pick up the weapons to kill the boss, the final boss, because <laughs> you can't kill him with a handgun. <laughs> Humans are too big. No, that makes sense actually. Perfect sense. No air, so you die. Maybe that's true. Can't breathe in a vacuum, right? <laughs> Perfect sense, man. Yeah, but um, the that trophy, I haven't done that yet to beat the game without using the um, storage box. That one's just a little too difficult for me. Um, I've only downloaded Shield Hero so far, I haven't watched it yet, and I haven't downloaded anything else. So maybe, maybe after I stream tonight or during my dinner break, I'll look for other stuff to download. Well, I hope it goes back, I think it's supposed to go back into the main storyline. Think something, something. Um, I think I saw the title, but I don't. I haven't looked at the synopsis. Um, there were a couple other things, right? Uh, wasn't there Doctor Stone was coming back and Spy Family was coming back as well? I don't know if I should just wait till they stack up and then just uh, binge watch them all at once. Just focus on the streaming for now. Uh, Tokyo Revengers too. Oh, yeah, that's right. There is quite a few good things to watch right now. And Jujutsu Kaisen is going on for like another 12 episodes, I think.
Yeah, this season seems pretty good so far, I think. I think um, Attack on Titan, right? The final season, part two or something? Or is that next, or is that next um, season? I still haven't watched... I, I don't know if it's... Um, I don't know if that's this season or next season. But yeah, it was like final part one, final part two. Yeah, it might have been on the next season list, maybe. I keep jumping ahead. But I stopped... I kind of stopped reading the manga... Um, basically, like, where the start of the final season started, I think. So, I'll have to try to jump back into it. I think, um, I think they announce One Punch Man Season 3 next season, maybe? Yeah, I know, the drawings for the manga aren't that good to compare to the, the animation. <laughs> the animation's a lot better <laughs> to watch. I mean... I feel like the story is told better though in the manga compared to the um, anime. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's back too, isn't it? Yeah, I'll, I'll have to watch that. Okay, yeah, there's like at least three or four new anime I can watch. Oh man, I can't catch any of these freaking monsters. I want to join my freaking party. Okay. I have to look into that. Dink. Oh, okay. Roy Baddock? Roy Baddock? Oh. Good. Fingers are in wrong position. The text because I'm back. I caught Ah, dang it, still haven't caught him. This is hard. <laughs> yeah, it knows, it knows. Dang it. Who can't catch one of these things? Ugh. Ugh. I'm gonna make a phone call after this, so I might not be back till like eight o'clock. I'll play uh play some Resident Evil. Just wondering if I should do. I might. I might do a clear run, but with the assault rifle first. First run. Just to get used to it. Rocket launcher is a little too easy. Oh, Goblin Slayer. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a good one. There was um, there was like a movie or um, OAV 
after the season two, after the first season. I'm not sure if that's um, probably not related in canon, I guess. Yeah, so probably probably after this, um, when I come back from break, um, Rosie will do clear B scenario, but with the assault rifle at the very least. At the assault rifle, um, I can kill all the zombies at least pretty easily, and then lickers just walk past them. The only, just the bosses will still be tough. bosses and then the sewer monsters. But I need to learn the mapping before. So I'll play it once, learn it, and then rerun it like later this week. <laughs> Standard. Claire gets like a different set of weapons too. Like her handgun's different. She gets the, the grenade launcher and then the, the taser, I think. Spark gun. I'll probably use those on the bosses. Catching any of these freaking monsters. On. Alright, join my party. Join my party. Join my party. Oh. Come on. We have the. How many have I killed? Am I at 64 yet? <laughs> have they announced anything for next season yet? Like anything confirmed? Okay, so AOT is probably next season, next season or later. They got um, Skiga Michibiku Isekai Dochi second season. That one was actually pretty funny. Like it's next uh, winter season or January. Yeah, in January. Ah, oh, come on. I'm not coming up. Oh, Mashal season two. Mashal is actually okay. It was better than I thought it would be. Basically like a Black Clover clone, I guess. Let's see. Common King Flower. Icon. These guys. These anime. Equal seasons. Um, nothing I, else I've really watched, so... Like this. Oh, 
put me on this. Okay, so winter season, I don't really know anything. Um, ah, but they're coming out with the Gundam Seed movie in, in January. Okay. What about spring? Have they actually announced? Oh, Mushoku Tensei Part 2 Season Part 2 is going to be spring of next year, so I guess that's... I assume that's set? Oh, that's like the only good thing that I see that's coming. Uh, later is One Punch Man Season 3. They don't have an actual set date. Ah, it's an Aiba. Oh, ReZero, I completely forgot about that. That's, I got a confirmed third season. Open no Hero, yeah, okay. Okay, I see. Oh, we'll go to the picking goal shot. I haven't watched that. I heard it was pretty good, though. Okay, maybe I'll have to watch that. Yeah, nice, nice drawings will reel you in. So they still have more bleach. I thought they finished. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Jeff said bleach was okay, but I mean, the manga was like pretty badly done for the last arc. Oops. I don't want to come here. Well, it doesn't matter where I save, I guess. There's a new Naruto anime coming out. I feel like it's just gonna be all fillers though. <laughs> Naruto Shinsaka anime. <laughs> I, I have a feeling it's just gonna be all fillers because the main story is done and... I mean, it's classic Naruto though. Yeah, it's not. it's not even like... Adult Naruto, it's like Kid Naruto again. So yeah, they're just milking it. <laughs> but it's like... They already did the main story, so it has to be all filler, right? <laughs> so, yeah, how could they go back and add more now? Unless they show like the Naruto training arc with Jiraiya or something. And the uh, Suska training arc or something that would be like, but it wouldn't. I feel like it wouldn't be that long of a series then. <laughs> so many fillers, and then Boruto Part Two as well. Okay, well, I couldn't catch any more cool stuff. I wanted the heel slime. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll Google it later to see if I can actually catch him in the tower, because that would be the easiest. Alright, well, I'm going to take a break. Um, yeah, i got to catch him all. I'm going to take a break, and um, I'll be back to play Resident Evil. I'll let you know um, when I start streaming. I'm going to make a phone call in a little bit. Alright, talk to you later. Bye.